Frank the Cooch. We're over here at Adverg Cemetery right now. Um, I know it's been a while since I filmed any videos. It's been extremely busy lately. Uh, we have been filming. Um, just got a brand new camera, so let me know down below if you like this camera over what we were using. So yeah, um, subscribe to my Instagram channel at Frank the Cooch. I'm here with B-Man. He's in the distance over there, as you can see. Um, haven't heard a whole lot about this cemetery as being haunted. I know it's an older cemetery. It's huge. If you want to take a look, this is a massive cemetery. Probably talking about 14 acres around this cemetery. Um, B-Man's got the voice recorder right now. Because his... Um, fully charged battery just died as soon as he got out of the, my vehicle so we're checking it out <clears throat> just got this brand new HD camera um, so yeah once again smash that like button let me know in the comments below if you see or hear anything that we may have missed um, we're gonna try to do some burst EVP sessions and uh, if we catch anything, we'll let you hear it right away. Otherwise, we'll have the EVPs um, edited in. <clears throat> so, yeah, here we go. If anybody is here, uh, B-Man is holding a uh, voice recorder. You could speak into that. Or you could speak directly into my camera. We will hear you and we will pass a message along if you need us to. Pictures of somebody on there. You see that? Check it out. They were like etched. 20 as I drive past this cemetery every day on my way back from work uh, I always feel like I should come here uh, every day I pass by it I come straight down that street right there and I pass by it and I feel like something's calling me to come here so I figured why not today um, let me know if you'd like to see any other types of videos we're actually going to be doing uh, <laughs> Pokemon Go in a little bit, we're going to go to a community park and uh, catch some Pokemon. Uh, yeah, so my kids got me back into that. Um, I guess it's starting to become popular again. Uh, anyway, yeah, just comment below if you'd like to see me do some videos with my kids. I'm trying to get them to come to some haunted places with me. My little one's not too uh, excited about that. But okay, so I'm going to keep quiet now and let me know. You see anything. Are there any veterans around here? I'd like to thank you for your service if there are. <clears throat> B-Man, I'm sorry, had like an anxious feeling when we pulled into this part of the cemetery. So that's why we're over here. We're going to go by the mausoleum soon. <clears throat> I just think some of these are really cool tombstones. The designs in them. 
I mean, you have like your regular on the ground tombstones, but then there's all these towering ones that uh, are pretty old, some of them. They just have really cool designs. but have died near it. I feel like there's a child that's roaming the cemetery. I think I've seen, I think I've seen you uh, passing by a couple times later in the evening. If you are here, you could speak to us or show yourself to us. Anybody who would like to show themselves to us Give us a sign of your presence. You could touch one of us. This B-man over there, he's always open to letting somebody uh, use his body. calling me to the cemetery somebody wanted me to come here I'd really like to know who that was you know I don't know if I'm a sensitive or I don't know if I'm a sensitive or not but there are times I feel or hear things um, that nobody else hears and if I play back I end up you know we end up hearing the things um, so I have been feeling like somebody's been telling me to come to the cemetery for a very long time now just haven't really had the time to do it so finally here now I'm hoping I catch something good I don't know I think we should go that way Toward the mausoleums on the other side of the cemetery, the older part of the cemetery, and uh, see if we can catch anything there. see or hear anything in the background that we may have missed and send your comments down below spam my Instagram page with it send some pictures of it <laughs> or sound bites Thank you. 
I heard a whistle. No, mark that. It was like a. really cool. It's not the shade either. It's like my head is freezing. Is there somebody here? Smell it? I have a feeling it's the flowers. Oh, those are fake. Huh? What? Is there an echo? Hey guys, I don't think I'm going to bring the backpack next time. It does make a lot of noise. That might have been some of the noises we're hearing right now. Uh, I have like suntan lotion and all, like bug repellent and everything in it. And you can hear it swishing around, so um, I'll be right back. It's going to drive over to the other part of the cemetery. Hey guys, we're back at the other part of the cemetery now. And I just heard some weird scream. Unfortunately, I wasn't recording at the time. I was just getting ready to start recording. Um, I did have my EVP recorder going. Hopefully we caught that. By these cool mausoleums here, be nice over there. Most of my rooms you probably told. There's like frost on the windows. Did you hear that scream? Ah, something's happening. It's probably from that Pioneer Park. Anybody who's buried in this mausoleum um, able to talk to us, speak into these little recorders. Kid in the other part of the cemetery screaming. Let's get this sneak peek of what's in these mausoleums over here. Anybody here that would like to communicate with me?
please let me know if you guys see anything or hear anything in the background once again. Is there anybody here? Like there may have been a child in here. Pretty old. Are there any children here? That's buried in this mausoleum. trying to get out. Can you please speak to me? So now, we don't post every video we make at every cemetery, um, just because we go to some cemeteries and we absolutely get nothing. And we're not trying to clickbait or anything. Um, it's only when we get heavy feeling at certain cemeteries. Or we get some good EVPs. Um, we're hoping that the video pulls something up and maybe somebody sees something in it that maybe we didn't.
really do a good job of keeping up the cemetery. Um, a lot of the cemeteries you go to are all grown over and they honestly look like crap. Uh, but the yard crew does a pretty good job here of keeping it clean. Most of these uh, graves or headstones are intact. Most of the time you go to a cemetery you see them broken, knocked over. There's a couple like that here but not many. Um, some of these are very nice sculptures too they have on the tops of these. Side here, they haven't even put a. Oh, there is a headstone by it. Hello? It up as soon as I put his voice recorder in the charger, it hopped up to 80% battery life. So, at the last part, I have no idea why it completely turned off, but I could not turn it back on. splitting up for the simple fact that um, for the simple fact that we want totally different EVPs uh, and I do record and I do talk a lot under my recordings um, I like getting answers he's more of a quiet type who just sits there and listens as opposed to uh, talking What I found is that the more questions you ask, the more responses you're going to get. Uh, most of the time when you just sit there, you get random words that you'll hear which make no sense. At least you can make some sense out of it when you ask a question and you get a response. <clears throat> and then again, we, we record in the daytime in a lot of the cemeteries. Because if a cemetery is haunted, um, it's haunted all the time. Granted, a lot more people see things at night just because it's less people out and it's a little quieter. But normally, we could pick up EVPs in the early morning, midday, doesn't even make a difference what time you're there. could just see how massive this cemetery is and then that's the other side we were on past that gate 
and that's, that's a pretty big part of the cemetery too. <coughs> The thing with Illinois, we have such a big population that some of these cemeteries are so overcrowded. Yeah, this, this is weird. This whole tombstone is shifted. Interesting. Hello? That was a weird noise. Listen for a noise on these recorders. So, oh, the fingers are missing on this one. Something's weird about this one. Is there anybody here that would like to communicate with me? I'm going to leave this voice recorder here. You could speak into it. <clears throat> Can you tell me your name? How old are you? Is there anything you would like to say to your family members? There's some of the broken fingers. If there's anybody here that would like to talk to us, um, you can tell us anything you'd like. You can attach yourself to B-Man, he doesn't mind. What year did you die? Can you please give us a sign of your presence? Make something move, touch one of us. I'd like to thank you if you spoke to us. Got a lot of military people buried here too. I'm seeing a bunch. Let's go check out some of these mausoleums on this side. Wow, oh, broken glass. Hmm. Oh, it's just a line of graves right here. That's crazy. Wow, they're all one family. Are they nuns? The Ostra. I mean, sister in Latin. I think that is. I think these are all nuns. Probably Franciscan nuns. <clears throat> Comment down below what that means. Siostra? Because right here I see a lot of Siostra. And then I see 
sister. So these are priests or nuns. Sister, sister. And what does Jostra mean? Oh, Siostra. I would really like to know what Siostra means. Because um, I see a lot of that on these graves right here. All of these say Siostra. Siostra. I'm assuming that's some kind of nun. Maybe a hierarchy of nuns. I have no idea. But I would like to know if there is life after death. I'm sure everybody has asked that question a million times. But if you are able to answer it, um, please do. How is heaven? Looks like somebody's looking out. I gotta go see what this is. That's so creepy. Oh, it just looks like a mosaic. From a distance, it looks like somebody was looking out of the window. Okay, let me see if I can pick up anything on my voice recorder here. Oh, look at that creepy face on the bottom. Wow. Is there anybody here that would like to communicate with us? If you can move something inside this mausoleum. Or you could speak into this little recorder. Can you like make one of those crosses move? With a little glass globe or the picture. guys seen anything move didn't look like it but you never know is there anybody in here you could speak to me it's so cold in this area make one of those crosses move or the candles to prove that you're here Most of these have like padlocks on them, some kind of chain locks. Is there anybody here? Can you please move one of those items on the altar? To prove that you are here with us.
going by right now. It's hard to get any good EVPs. This one has fresh flowers on the floor. Look like it got knocked over by something. If you are still in here, can you prove that you are in here by moving something? Can you make one of those candles move or the flower pot that's on the floor? When I look into any one of these mausoleum windows, if you guys can make something move, um, that way you could prove that you are here. Uh, looks like D-Man's ready to go. I'm going to keep you guys on there for a few seconds. Let me know if you see anything move. That's a creepy doll. Oh, that's Jesus. Whoops. Sorry. Faded pictures. Anybody who uh, sees or hears anything that are in the background of my videos, please comment down below. Make sure you hit that like button and subscribe to my channels. Uh, we're going to go over some EVPs and uh, our videos and post any sounds or any noises we may have gotten. Uh, so this is the Coochin B-Man heading out. See you guys real soon. Peace.